Alright, now it's time to get your geometry ready. So let's say you have your animation loop all ready to go. Your guy's animated. Awesome. Um, some important things to note are uh, he's facing down the X axis. Um, that's important to know. Uh, this is a 20 frame loop. If you notice, I only have my time range set to 19 because um, we're going to cycle through this animation and once it gets to this frame, if we went to 20, it would be this frame again and it would pop. So we're just going to cut off that last frame so we can get a smooth animation. So with him selected, um, I have this script ready to go, and um, it duplicates what you have selected um, for every frame of the loop you're going to use. Um, another thing to note is if your character has more than one object, um, like say his goggles were a separate piece of geometry, you'd want to put everything in a group select that group and then run the script but since he's one piece of geometry I don't have to worry about that so with everything selected I'm gonna hit enter on my number pad so the code stays there and it duplicates everything for every frame and then we don't need any of this other stuff so we have 1 through 19 frames of animation of our loop that we're going to instance onto our particles.